hello guys welcome to my channel if you are facing the blue screen of death error on your windows this video is for you whatever error code and stop code you have i am going to show you how you can resolve this issue easily okay i have categorized this video into two parts so as you can see i am getting diagnostic my pc it is not booting for those users who are able to access their PC, they can press shift and hold the shift key and then click on restart button. They get the startup repair screen. And for those users who are not able to access their PC like mine. So whatever option you are getting, you should see the startup repair. Your PC did not start correctly option. If not, then you can forcefully shut down your system two to three times. As soon as the manufacturer logo appears, you need to shut it down, hold the power key for 10 to 15 seconds and then restart it. You will get the same screen. Okay. Once you are on a startup repair screen or advanced screen, whatever option you are getting, startup repair could not repair your PC or the other option, you need to click on the advanced options here. Then click on the troubleshoot option then again click on startup advanced options now you will see here the six options first we will try the repair our windows with the command prompt so click on the command prompt now you may have to enter the password you need to type here one command here sfc space slash scan now SFC stands for system file checker which will scan all the corruption inside your windows and repair automatically. You need to wait for process to complete. After completing this command we will hit another command to repair the hard drive issues, SSD and SDD issues. So let it finish first. Now this command is completed, one more command you should try to repair the hard disk issue which is chk tsk space slash f space c colon c is the where the window is installed, hit enter and this might take few minutes, you need to have enough patience once the command is completed, you need to exit out from the command and you can continue with Windows 10, okay? If this step is not working, we have couple of more options. We can troubleshoot, click on troubleshoot. If not resolve your issue, advanced options. Now click on the system restore. Okay. If your system is automatically created the system restore on your windows, you should see the options to click on next. Otherwise, you are not able to click on the next options since the uh, restore point is not created on our windows. So I have manually created the system restore point on this date. Once you click on next, you should see the finish option first. Now. Before trying this method, your system will be restored when the system was created. When the system restore point was created. Since your system is going to restore on that day, you can see the, all the dates here. When the system time was created. So my system will be restored for that day. So click on the yes option after that. And this might take few minutes. So wait for process to complete. It is initializing. Now click on the restart option. Once the restore point is done, your system will be restored. If this method is not working on your windows, system restore point you have not created. So you can move to the next method.
recovery option and the click on restart advanced startup we are getting this option again you need to have you need to have patience to troubleshoot the blue screen of death watch this video till end your issue will be resolved again click on troubleshoot again click on start of advanced options now we can see the more options you need to click on here start up repair enter the password i have not created password so click on continue click on advanced options again click on troubleshoot okay this time troubleshoot uh, we have tried almost all the options here which can fix this issue so go back click on reset this pc okay choose this option carefully choose keep my files and remove everything if your data is important then you can choose this option keep my file and if your data is not important you can choose this option remove everything you can back up your data in a d drive and the other drive since your c drive is going to format okay all the install program which you have manually installed will be wiped out will be deleted before trying this method you should keep your data otherwise your data may loss so you can choose this option keep my files okay resetting this pc this is the last option you should try if the none of the steps are not working or the last method you can try create a bootable media and then install the windows fresh installation and check your hardware so this is how you can troubleshoot the blue screen of death error so hope your issue is fixed now so yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching